What's up, you guys? My name is Mary. I'm with High Priestess Intuition. Welcome to my current subscribers and welcome, 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 newbie. If you guys are new to my channel and you enjoy my content, you can ring the bell and be uh, notified for future readings. Just saying, just saying, saying. This is a channeled message. Um, I wasn't planning on doing any of these, but they're just coming to me, so we're doing them. Um, it's very, uh, very important to only take the messages that resonate with you for your general reading. So don't forget the basics. Time is fluid. Energy is fluid. If it doesn't apply, uh, let it fly. Everyone has free will. Only take the messages that resonate. So <clears throat> the channel I received, it's actually a wonderful one. I heard um, you have been very, very giving and loving to other people in the universe. It's your time to receive back now. That's what I heard. So that's at least for one person in the universe. That's beautiful. If that resonates for you, you've been very giving, loving, and um, to other people in the universe. So the universe in general. So you don't go around causing crimes. You don't go around doing hate crimes. You, if this is for you, I don't feel you go around doing hate crimes, uh, putting sugar in people's gas tanks, putting rats in air filters, destroying other people's property, um, whether it's a business, a vehicle, or a home. Um, you don't, um, you don't cause harm to other people, whether it's mental, physical, or verbal. Um, now speaking the truth is one thing I just want to say, speaking the truth is one thing. If somebody's being a butthead to you or being an asswipe to you or being malicious or nasty to you, you know, standing up to yourself for yourself is one thing. If they're being those things, then yeah, if you're calling them out and saying they're being those things, or if it's something happened in the past. That's one thing. Standing up for yourself is one thing. I'm talking about unnecessary, unnecessary, not provoked, not provoked reactions, unnecessary reactions, like sticking hidden cameras in people's homes unnecessarily or gang, gang stalking or bullying or harassment or beratement or something of that nature. That's what I'm talking about. Not the provoked kind. Um, that's what I'm feeling. Um, I feel you say to yourself, I uh, feel you say to yourself, you're very peaceful. You do not harm other people unintentionally. You um, take care of yourself or take care of your children if you have children. And, or if it's not your children, it could be other people you're taking care of um, in your family or not in your family. But you, um, you take care of people. You are a healer, uh, whether it's spiritual realm or physical realm or both. You heal. You heal the universe. You heal the world. And um, um, people are seeing this, I feel. And they're about to, it's about, the universe is about to bless you in a very positive way. I heard it's your turn now. So I feel whoever this is for, you were abused in some shape, form, or fashion in the past. Whether it's sexual, verbal, physical, mental, spiritual, one or all those things. And now it's time for the universe to bless you in a positive way um now however whatever blessings that is that could be um let me see if i hear anything else some are about to get blessed financially Some are about, about to get unexpected court rulings in their favor because a series of chain of events. Lots of drama. Okay. Um, so you plug it in how it resonates. Um, so if this resonates for you, um, some of you guys are about to get blessed financially. And some of you guys are about to get unexpected court rulings in your favor because of lots of drama. So you plug that in, how that resonates. So somebody's attempting to cause drama with you or they have caused drama with you in the past or there's some kind of history of drama in some kind of court situation um, and you're about to get an unexpected court ruling in your favor, in your favor, which is beautiful, beautiful energy. Whoever this is for, you're, you're not, you know, you're a very peaceful person. You're very peaceful. Um, very, very, very peaceful. Not malicious. Okay, I heard very, very, very peaceful, not malicious. So you're very, very, very peaceful. You're not malicious. So you don't do things in the dark, behind the scenes. Um, I feel you're very straightforward. For some, you might be too straightforward. Like, 
well, there's no such thing as too straightforward, in my opinion. You're you're very blunt. I feel I feel you're very blunt. Um, you just tell it how it is. Um, and I feel that ruffles people's feathers that try to manipulate you is what I feel. For some of you guys. Um, for some, it's the unexpected court rulings in your favor. For some, it is financial. And for some, it is both. And for some, it is both. And for some, it is both. Okay, well, that's beautiful. That's beautiful. If that resonates for you, that this truly is a beautiful reading. It really, it is. It's a beautiful channel reading. It really is. Um, but there's some, um, there's two situations here. One is financial. One is the unexpected court ruling in your favor. For some, it's both. So um, that's really, let me see if I hear anything else. That's really beautiful. Through many series of chain of events, eyes are about to be open to true maliciousness. History of maliciousness. Okay, I heard through many series of chain of events, eyes are about to be open to maliciousness. Um, history of maliciousness. So um, that could be why you're getting this unexpected financial blessing for some. For some, that could be why you're getting this unexpected court ruling in your favor. For some, it could be why you're getting both. You plug it in how it resonates, but there's some kind of history of malicious behavior towards you from one person or several people, however that resonates. Um, but it sounds like eyes are being open to this or they have already been open or they're about to be open, however that resonates. Um, and something's about to go in your favor. I heard you give, 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 give to others, people in the universe in the past. It sounds like it has not been returned to you. Um, but it is about to be returned to you. It is about to be returned through many series of chain of events. You will really be able to grow and manifest yourself and others in a legal way. Okay. Well, that's a good one. This is a great one. So I heard um, basically through many series of chain of events, um, sounds like com coming up, you will be um, able to grow and manifest yourself in a legal way. So it sounds like you're going to get some kind of large financial um, blessing. That could be a new job, a, a new business endeavor with somebody. That could be a settlement, a payout, a um, lawsuit um, settlement, um, something of that nature is what I'm feeling. Um it could be child support for some of you guys. For some, it could be child support. Um, for some, it could be something else. But some kind of unexpected financial blessing that you, it sounds like was held back from you in the past. But it's about to come to you now because um, people are opening their eyes to some kind of malicious intent. A history of malicious intent that was done to you in the past. Um, if that resonates for you. Um, this is beautiful. Let me see if I hear anything else. You did not fight back physically. You did not do harm to others. You just lived your life. And people know this. Okay, I heard you did not fight back physically. You did not do harm to others. And um, people know this. So something happened to you in the past where you were taken advantage of in some shape, form, or fashion, if this resonates with you. Um, it was so bad that it may, probably made you want to do something physically to first in people, place, or situation because it was so bad. It, like the, it was like stomping on your liberties and um, freedoms so bad that it just made you so mad. But you could have made the free willing choice to fight back physically. For some, it, you know, weapons. For some, it could have been weapons you wanted to use. For some, it could have been um, going out and physically harming somebody, but you did not. You did not do it. You didn't do it. You, you self-controlled yourself. You did not use a weapon. You did not use harm. You did not use physical force. You did not use violence. Um, whoever this resonates with, you were peaceful. Um, and people realize this now. They realize the self-control that you have shared and exhibited within yourself. I heard you just went on and you accepted it and you lived your life. So you know what happened to you. 
or it could have been you or somebody you're connected to, somebody you love. For some, it could have been your children it happened to. But you knew it was not the smart idea to go out and physically harm somebody, physically, you know, bash somebody's head in or use a weapon on somebody or, you know, like that one news link with the lady that went to the gas station with the gun and basically blew her head off with the with the um, gun, militant style. She just went up and, pew, 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 pew. I mean, true story. That's one of the news links on here. Um, and that was over fighting over a man. That was fighting over a man. Whoever this is for, it was much, much worse. I feel it stomped on your rights and liberties or rights and liberties are you and your children. And it was much more terrible than fighting over a man is what I'm trying to say. But you just kept living your life and going on about your business and minding your business like you're supposed to do. And people are really realizing this. Let me see if I hear anything else. And you're about to be blessed for it. Okay, I didn't. I didn't hear anything else. Okay, well, this is a great one. Oh, well, congrats, whoever this is for. I would love to know if you want to tell me. I respect everybody's privacy. You know that. I love you guys so much. Everybody make wonderful choices, and namaste.